He commits adultery. Com okay. There needs to be four witnesses, but it's um, wouldn't it, would it not be haram to look at someone committing adultery, and that and so how could there be four witnesses? That so does that does that mean it has to be done in public for there to be a punishment for it? Okay, adultery can only be proved by the witness of or by the testimony of four male Muslim witnesses being present at the time of adultery. And this has never been recorded in the history of Islam to my knowledge. Because no one is going to be, quote unquote, excuse my friends, shagging a woman and then all of a sudden having four witnesses watching and he's doing his business as usual. This is not heard of and was not, never founded. And probably this is why Islam conceals such a sin to prevent people from slandering. So you cannot just accuse a man for being in a room with a, a, an unmahram woman. You cannot accuse them of committing adultery because you have to have four witnesses seeing the actual act, which is not possible. So if a person was doing it in broad daylight on the street and four passerby see this, they're not going to go and wait and like take selfies. They've saw it. It's a, a, a single glance of a second or two. That's sufficient. So there is no sin on them because this was not uh, premeditated. It's, it happened and they saw it. So there's no sin. And the reason for witnessing it is to prove that such a major sin had taken place and they would testify for it. So this is justifiable and Allah Azza wa Jal knows best.